welcome to the dollhouse. This is your girl, baby doll. So today, well, it's actually night. We went out, we had dinner. We stopped by our friend's house. So now I'm going to remove my makeup. So like everybody else, everybody has, you know, they skincare routine or how they remove their makeup i told y'all in a haul one of my favorite things that i use this from dollar tree which works really good but you wipe off the makeup but you still got to you know wash your face um i use neutrogena oil free eye makeup remover first i put it on a cotton uh pad or cotton ball and do the eyes and then i come in and use neutrogena hydro boost hydrating gel um it effectively removes makeup and impurities that's what this look like so the other day i was in tj maxx and i ran across this melt away from the cream shop. I don't know if y'all can see that. So I'm going to test how this goes. So you open it up. It comes with a little scooper type of situation. Um, this is what it looks like. I already dig my finger in it to see what was the consistency. So you're supposed to take a little scoop, um, dry face. And we're gonna see how this is supposed to actually cleans all your makeup off your face but you still gotta wash your face after but it's supposed to really take it off so let's see how this goes so i'm gonna rub it in my hands and i got all full coverage foundation oh my god i got everything on highlighter eyeshadow mascara we gonna work it in let's see i don't know if y'all can see so we gonna work it in every nook and cranny and see how so it's definitely oily. So I guess that's what helps with the removal of the makeup. I like my water hot. I don't know. Some people are like, oh, it's supposed to be lukewarm, this and that and the other. I have a thing. If the water is not hot, then we're not clean. But well, that's my that's my thing. Okay, so we're moving the makeup from my hands. So it's taking the water. A minute to warm up. Okay. I guess I can start now going back to the nail salon and get my nails done. The water's still not as hot as I like. So I'm waiting. It's kind of warm. I like it hot. Mm. 
Oh, here we go. So you're supposed to take a damp cloth. So now that my face is nice and dry, I'm going to go in with my serums. So I use Tree of Life, the retinol. the vitamin C and the hydroronic acid. Can you see that? Um, it's no particular order that I use them. So I'm just gonna take a small amount I usually just mix all three together instead of doing one by one and waiting for my face to dry. And then I just go in and work it. And work it. So we're gonna let that dry. And this is the makeup turban. I think I got this at Walmart. You put it on when you wanna wash your face, keep put on your makeup to keep your hair out, you know, off your face. Don't ask me how much it is, because I don't remember. I got it a while ago. All right, so now, after I did use these serums, I'm gonna go in with some moisturizer. I use this. Um, this right here helped me a lot with my dark, under eye um, thing. It's not as bad as it used to be. I used to use L'Oreal Eye Defense. Can y'all see that? But I don't use this anymore. I don't. I only moisturize this. Um, moisturize with this, like all over my face. And it helped with the dark circles. Like, it's really getting better. And I think I've been using this for like two weeks now. So I'll go in. With this collagen moisturizer. And that's it. 
I'm all done. Ready to take a shower and get in the bed. So this is my makeup remover nighttime routine. Thanks for tuning in. Um, I'll leave um, a description. I mean, I will leave the names of everything I use in the description box. Thank you for watching by watching, not watching by watching. <laughs> Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel for more content. All right, good night. Mm -hmm.